Welcome to Gary Springer's show. Today we have a, a dynamic lady from Dallas Fort Worth area. Her name is Tracy Ross, and she's involved in this uh, magazine. It's called uh, Let me look at <laughs> LiveWithChildren.com. It's a sports site, isn't it? And tell us how this all evolved. And you said earlier when you was talking to me that your friends are just networking with your friends, and that's how it all started. So. Start it up. Tell me what, <laughs> what's all involved. Yeah. Well, um, I have a friend that has a television pilot and a um, website called Predators.tv. And that is a show for um, individuals that want to learn more about crime and, and preventing becoming a victim. And if you're a victim, there's tons of victim resources there. And I've been helping her with that and uh, contributing to her newsletter. Um, and I have another friend who has a website called goddessmag.com, and that's for the um, that's for the demographic. I believe it's 35 to 54 mm -hmm. uh, women plus sizes. And so I've done some modeling and whatnot for her. Mm -hmm. And um, I guess I just kind of saw a need for single parents to have a resource that they could use to help them with um, raising their children with. Um, discipline, manners, financial help, um, and it kind of evolved into realizing that there isn't just single parents, there's grandparents raising their grandchildren, there's and aunts and uncles raising grandchildren. Yeah, so it's kind of, a, a, I, I'm setting it up, um, it's being, we're formatting everything currently, it should be up by the time this is aired, um, and we're just going to have resources for all aspects of life. Well, just talking to you, you have a personal approach because you're very easy to talk to, and that's a plus in this line of what you're doing, living with children, you know, your, your magazine. And uh, I think that's what it takes. And you said something, you have a message board and all this. Yeah. You know, developing on We're going to have a message board. We, I, I think it's really important for people to be helping people. I think right. we need to support each other. Um, and I heard a study on the, ra on the TV, rather, and I believe it was... We're down to two friends on average. We have two friends each, and some people don't talk. That's pathetic. Isn't it? It's horrible. It they really don't. Is. It, they don't talk to. There's some people that don't talk to another person, another human being, all day long. Mm -hmm. And you know, thankfully, with the internet, if if there's some reason why you you can't get out, um, you know, we we do have message board, um, and it'll carry. Eventually, we'll have several different message boards for different right. topics. But you can get on there and and help each other out if somebody has a question. And we'll also have a live chat and yeah, a live was, was, yeah, mm -hmm. and the live chat will sometimes be scheduled. So it'll be kind of like okay. a yeah, it'll be like a talk radio show, and right. um, people can call or write type in their questions and and have the expert that's that's scheduled at that time period to answer their question. So that's kind of neat too. It kind of helps people learn from a personal standpoint. So it's really designed for the whole family. I mean, teenagers, yeah. I mean, you know, there's accountability of everything and parents are, you know, raising their children. But sometimes the children, it's hard for kids to ask parents certain questions because, you know, pressures and, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but if you got really got a strong relationship with your son or daughter, that's good. But a lot well, of parents don't have that, and they're trying to access information. They're getting really the wrong information. This, and that's why I like about what you were telling me earlier. That's a big part of what we're doing with the um, information with the website right. is you know building that relationship with your family. Right. Um, we we don't so much cater to the children. Um, where the children can log on. It's more for the adults. Right. But we're not. It You're like open a, to, I mean. Right. Yeah. We're, we're going to help them with all different kinds of topics and building relationships um, with each other, with coworkers, and with their kids, with right. extended family. I mean, sometimes we have extended family problems. <laughs> um, and we're going to, to help them get tips and, and things that they can actually implement in their everyday life. Right. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's a big part of it. And um, 
Oh, I just lost my train of thought. <laughs> well, let me ask you this. Uh, you th I think inve investing in finances is really, if you get that down right, I think two people marry relationships a lot better because mm -hmm. I was watching Oprah the other day, and that's probably the biggest factor cause of divorce because one person's charged and the other person's paying the bills, and that puts a lot of stresses on family. And, and, um, and I, I believe your website will help a lot of people in that area. You know, given, given uh, certain web pages to go to or, you know, sites to go to to get the info right. that they need, and there's no cost to them. Yeah, you know. right. Right. And we have an organization expert, um, you know, and, and we have a design a designer that's been in the business 45 right. years. And, you know, we may not always live where we want to live. We may be a little cramped, but if you can if you can paint, you know, we have a, a faux finisher also on, on uh, our board. And, um, right. you know, paint isn't that expensive, and it can make a big impact when you do the faux finishing. So, you right. know, if we can make your interior look nicer, that puts everybody in a better mood when you have people, you know, with right. building your sense. relationships, that puts people in better mood. You get organized, then you're not yelling and screaming as much <laughs> and looking for something, you're organized. So all the different aspects in life that will collectively make your life a lot easier. I mean, at first it may be a little hard to get used to because it's not your routine, but, you know, we work with nutrition too and um, mm -hmm. address the, the physical needed. fitness. And That's definitely needed. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So in even your workplace because it's all part of our life. So we just want people to be able to, uh, you know, to come and, and find resources that they need. You know, maybe they want to build a home and they want to look at different right. uh, home builders, um, you know, that kind of thing. Okay. And um, you was, we was talking about earlier for the program, um, the subject of getting out the house. Yeah, absolutely. And that makes a world of difference. Just pushing yourself just one day a week. I know it's hard because everybody works, everybody, and they're tired, and, you know, they get the television <laughs> you watch, and, you know, they, get, they come with couch potato <laughs> or just lazy. Right. And, but you said yourself, you know, if I didn't get out, I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing now. That's right. You never know. And I look need. at you, you're such a, you know, you're a young lady, and you you've got life just ready to grab hold of, and I said, well, that's the first one to sit off in the first place. <laughs> Well, I, I will, I do, I will hibernate if I can, <laughs> and it's not, it's not, it's not good, it's not the best thing you can do, and, you know, everything that I've ever done in my life has been because I was out, whether I was babysitting or, um, you know, going to a worship service. Um, worship service, of course, is, is an easy one, because a lot of times you can get a ride, ride there if you, if you right. don't have a car, um, but there's also a place online now called meetups.com. And you can join a ukulele group. You can join, you know, a scrapbooking group. Um, there's all different kinds of groups there. And all you have to do is punch in your, your zip code, and it'll pop up what's in your area. So I think that's the neatest thing, and I really want to help promote that, too, on our site because it's important for people to get out and just meet people. You don't have to necessarily go to a, a support group. Even just it's supportive, just go into a group uh, that has an interest that, that you share. Okay. Uh, what would you like to share about just, you know, relationships of families? What would you like to say? I mean. Well, I'm not an expert. So. Well, who is? <laughs> I need my magazine. That's why uh. That's why my magazine came into existence because it was something I needed. And I, I was like, wait what, a minute. In other words, what do you think, I mean, when, as you, on a personal level, what do you think you need is in your family the most? You know, the, the, the easiest thing and the most important, I think, is to be nice to each other. You know, just be nice and be respectful. And I used to, I used to work and I had to drive, you know, traffic and all that. And uh -huh. we'd get up in the morning and I'm like, come on, hurry up. And, <laughs> you know, kids in the morning are not easy animals to deal right. with. And, and you're kind of tired, too. And, you know, yelling at them, come on, come on. And I finally stopped. I thought, you know what? It doesn't make them move any faster, and it, it starts off the whole morning wrong. So, mm -hmm. I, you know, I think of being nice to each other is a really important, um, really important thing. And watching your temper, I was a victim of uh, domestic, or not domestic, but of, um, of uh, 
physical assault. Mm -hmm. And um, that really got me upset. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and there was an anger that isn't, hasn't, wasn't there before. Mm -hmm. And um, I tell you, you can control it. And, and if you do have something inside that's causing you to be angry, you can control it. And we have to with our families. And I think with our families, we feel safe to be, right. you know, ourselves, safe let our right. hair down. And that includes yelling sometimes, but right. it, isn't, it isn't helpful. Yeah, pain is, I see it everywhere. I see a lot of sad faces everywhere, you know. Um, I'm out in everywhere every day all over Dallas community. And let me tell you. Nobody says anything, nobody. They're all strangers, and it's just like <laughs> come and go, and there's no interaction on any level, really. Very few times I see people talking to each other. If it is, it's about football. Well, you know, football is so general, but as far as knowing an individual, want to get to know an individual, the word friends, like I said, <laughs> I think it's just a, it's easy for everything. <laughs> yeah, just, um, and, and um, you know, Kids now consider an online friendship, a relationship, just, you know, chatting back and forth. Mm -hmm. And I enjoy the Internet, too, and I've met some neat people on the Internet. But you've got to have, I mean, we're phys we need the physical contact with people. All right. So I think it's really important to um, foster relationships that are close to you, too. Let's see. Uh, let me see what else. I had another question in my mind. I'm trying to think what it is. Uh, so... The market you were in target is just, you know, certain age people, you know, 25 to 40, married and everything, because they're the working class people in essence. Right. And they're, and, uh, well, so you see, you see, a, you, do you see a, uh, a, a real big need for this web page? I mean, do you see it daily? Yeah, well, I mean, one thing that you have with the family magazines we actually go up to age 54 and over, right. actually over that too, because you, like I said, you have grandparents. I mean, anybody that's involved with children in any way in their family um, can, can benefit from our site. But um, most of the magazines for families are geared for toddlers. I mean, once, the, once your kiddo gets over three or four, the family mag, you know, the, the children's magazine really doesn't, doesn't fit right. you anymore. So we're kind of gearing ourselves more for the for the little ones, yes, but all the way up to 18 and even past 18 into college because, you know, when you're an aunt or an uncle that doesn't have any children yourself, you know, you got to you have to wonder what kind of what kind of gifts do those aged kids like? Um, you know, what can you talk to them about? What's going on in their world? So, um, we try to we try to we're trying to catch the older Right. families yeah. and so you're going to have the older the people you know up in their 50s and 60s and uh well information you got earlier you you know you have real life models people right like know, myself <laughs> <laughs> you know to help them to build their dreams and exactly you know, expand Ex on that if you would exactly well you know like myself i need to lose a few pounds and there's all these diets and what diet do you choose and you know <laughs> and um there's a Dr. Steve Schnur who's a cardiologist, and he's he's going to uh, talk to us a little bit. He has a book out. Um, it's called the Reality Diet. Reality Diet. The Reality, and and it's real, R E A L, <laughs> and then he, in little letters it's I T Y, and um, he talks about just healthy eating. And you know, there's all these different diets, and there's all these different things that you can do, but you know, we don't do them. And um, mm. there's another gal, Joyce Price, that has a book coming Joyce out. Price. Joy, have you heard of her? I think I have. Um, she has a book, an upcoming book too, about how diets are a nightmare, and um, so I can be a model for that. And um, <laughs> organization, I can be a model for that too. I need organization. Um, but you know, we'll find people in other families that that are lacking or struggling with the same thing as many other families, and we'll kind of follow them and see how they're right. doing. And that's another aspect of the website. Um, uh, we have a section called, um, uh, now I forgot the name of it. I just came up with it last <laughs> night. I just came up with it last night. Um, reasons to believe. And yeah, those are, those are life's little miracles. I mean, things that you could never imagine would happen. You know, write them into us and let us know what your little miracle was. A page, 
I'm trying not to go over a page, but you know, a paragraph to a page, right. um, your little miracle of what happened, and you know, give us hope that there's a higher power out there for us. And there's yeah, another one, um, Tales of Our Lives, and that's another little section where people can write in and tell us funny little stories that happened to them, whether you know they were they had Mr. Fix It come over, or their husband was trying to be Mr. Fix It and <laughs> and totally botched the job, or you know, just any of the little funny things, maybe funny things that their kids have said to them, and um, and that's another neat thing. And then I have one other section that we could use your viewers, and that's our short stories. I want to okay. have short stories. If anybody writes short stories and they want it published, they can send it in to us, and we'll and if they're willing to have it on the website, we'll we'll put it on the that's website. Cool. That's for different. Them. Yeah, so that way we have a little. Yeah, we have a little bit of entertainment, you know, mm -hmm. a little bit of support group, a little bit of experts helping us out. It's it's kind of a little bit of everything. Have you seen any other um, businesses? I mean, not business, but something like this on the I internet. Have, I've not. I haven't. You haven't. Mm -mm. I haven't either. I mean, I mean, there's a lot of um, websites that tell you how to do crafts with your kids and that sort of right. thing. But I'm not a crafty person, so we're not having crafts. <laughs> Yeah, because you do character building, real estate, fitness. And mm -hmm. Yeah, and the character whole. building is really, really important because um, we have uh, Deborah and Fred Jones from Jones 2000 and Beyond. Okay. Um, some of your viewers might be familiar with them. And they are actually going to help us with that in parenting classes and discipline techniques and, and all that sort of thing. So. Yeah, because my son sometimes he just, I said, why would you do that? I don't know. <laughs> I said, well, you got to have a reason. I don't care. <laughs> I mean, he goes dumb on me. I mean, literally, he just shuts up like a clam. And he knows he's done wrong, but he ain't going to, you know, <laughs> that's his own way of getting out of things. But overall, you know, but a family, you know, like this webpage you got, uh, livingwithchildren.com, I think it's going to be, it's going to blow up Dallas away, I think. We yeah. need that. Well, I think we all. all I think it needs it worldwide. You know. Absolutely. And the neat thing is, if we mm. don't have something, or if you're mm -hmm. an expert in an area, you know, give us a call and let us know what you're doing. And um, I'll we'll give you a call. <laughs> yeah, come on. We the can, old Gary Springer show. We can. Yeah. Um, we can incorporate that um, into into our program. You know, mm -hmm. into what we're doing. We're all about what what people need. You know, right. and if I've missed something, um, you know, come tell us and just write us an email. And okay. we'll try to include that. So once you give the viewing audience, tell Dallas your email address oh, or your, whatever you want to do. I mean, go with it, you know. It's uh, info, I-N-F-O, at livingwithchildren.com. Okay. Everybody hear that? You want to say it one more time? It's info, I-N-F-O, at livingwithchildren.com. Okay. Well, now they know how to contact you. Praise God. Uh, so you're the owner and publisher of Living with Children. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. <laughs> Never thought I'd be doing this in my life. It just happened. Uh, God works in mysterious ways. Yeah. So um, it really is. A it's miracle. been on your heart for a long time. I, about a year. I just right. kind of was tinkering with it, and then all of a right. sudden it exploded. That's and what it usually happened. does. <laughs> it just happened. I was shocked. So. All right. Well, I think you got a really. Good thing going, I think. You know, like I say, everybody needs info and, you know, can s save a lot of hearts, keep them, hardships happening, just like on the financial aspect. Yeah, if we can prevent something or help somebody, you know, get out of where they're at. Um, mm -hmm. And there's a lot of programs out there, and that's one thing that we do, um, too, is we're advertiser-based. So without right. advertisers, we don't have we don't have any magazine. <laughs> right. um, and so uh, it's there's a lot of really great products out there. So if, you know, someone has done a program to maybe help them uh, with their debt recovery or something, mm -hmm. um, give us give us their name so we can contact them and see if they'd like to share with other people that, you know, that that was a successful company. Because we want to try to have referrals from our readers so that right, uh, yeah. we know that the company was successful for someone else and, um, you know, not just somebody that is trying to get business and, and may not be that great. And the other thing that we kind of do <clears throat> is a virtual expo. And I was talking about that earlier. If you were building a house or, um, or remodeling your house and you wanted to look up bathroom fixtures or what have you, um, we're also going to do that uh, all areas you can just get online and look okay. we have all kinds of categories so if anyone is a manufacturer of furniture or um, 
air conditioners or radios or TVs, they can <laughs> they can uh, come on and advertise with us, and it's a virtual expo so that people can go through and browse what uh, what's out there and what manufacturers are out there. Fantastic. Yeah, because, uh, you know, I guess I'm, I want to get my finances in order. You know, I think everybody needs to really f put a lot of focus on that because when you buy with a credit card, you don't feel the pain. And, <laughs> and people would slam the credit card, I buy this, and at the end of the month they get a thousand dollar charges on there so, and a credit card I think is really designed for emergencies but it's used for more junk because people has an impulse to buy and that's what credit card companies go on. Well I think mm -hmm. I heard the average in Dallas was like 15,000 for mm -hmm. families in, in credit card debt and you know I think the biggie is um, lunches. Lunches are so expensive but I think everybody puts it on their credit card and they kind of forget know. about it like you're talking and um, we're just so hectic you know and if we can somehow organize people's lives and we can, you know, right. show them some ways they can take lunch to work, um, you know, maybe we can show them the shortcuts. That'll help a lot of families, just the financial It really recipes. does. It's really amazing. But, you know, sometimes mm. you don't want to reheat something in the microwave. And there's other ways to yeah. do it or maybe, you know, come up with some. If anybody has good recipes, they can send them in. <laughs> good sandwich recipes. I heard the word dip means don't even buy that. Oh, I love that. <laughs> That's funny. But, uh, <laughs> but it, it, people, like I said, I think it makes them feel worthy to have a card or something. I don't know. And But cash, like I say, I'm happy. You're happy. You get the cash. I get right. the product. I don't have to look back on my shoulder. Yeah. But uh, I think you really got a revolution ideal here. I mean, it's really, I never heard this before. I really haven't. I mean, I heard like, you know, how to fix up your house, web pages. But right. in general, you know, that you take it all in, you know, yeah, and that's it right. All into one. But you know, that's good because people don't want to jump from one thing to another exactly. and, and their time is important to them. And they don't want to go 15 different websites and looking at right. this and they just want to go one general webs, da, 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 yeah. you know, click, and click, we, click. We can't possibly, I mean, we can't possibly have everything, but all of our issues, um, our first, first issue won't come out until September 15th. Okay. But, um, we will, we are online. You can, you can see what we are going to have. Um, but, um, we, we're going to try to encompass as much as possible and all of our issues will be archived. So you, okay. can, you can search the site and find an article, you know, we'll have, we'll have lots of articles and maybe not every department because it is so vast will change every month, but we'll put mm -hmm. up front, you know, what's changed this month. And, um, we have our regular contributors, like I said, and, um, and basically we just need your viewers to get on and tell us what they want so that we can all provide right. what they need. To the best of our ability. And I like where you, you know, combine with experts and everything, and that makes a difference. Yeah, the real people and the experts <coughs> and get them together. And, yeah, I think it's it's a neat combination. Right. It's something that I would like, and, and right. that's just basically what I'm doing. I'm trying to do what I need and what mm -hmm. would be appealing to me. Um, we're even doing power tools and everything in our expo. Really? Yep. So if the ladies want to get on there and uh, <laughs> find some <laughs> power tools that. for their husbands or the guys need something, um, we're going to try to review some new gadgets and whatnot that come yeah. out. So I seen, I seen a commercial on uh, Home Depot or something, and <laughs> the guy breaks his old tool on purpose to get a new product. <laughs> you know, fire tool. <laughs> he drops it. Well, I got to go find another product. <laughs> he did on purpose. You know, run over with a car. I think. He said, "Baby, my tools are gone, and <laughs> got to go buy some new Dewalt tools or whatever. <laughs> you know, get a thousand dollars." I know. That's a, that's a, people do that. I think they really do. Yeah. Tired of losing you. Same old, same old. But uh, <laughs> Tracy, I think you got a dynamic idea. I really believe that, you know, you're going to help a lot of families. I, well, hopefully. All ages, yeah. you know. You across the board on everything. Yeah. And I like that, livingwithchildren.com, you know. That's, that's sharp. <laughs> yeah. So we're just, you know, hopefully we can take people that are already financially secure and help them, you right. know, achieve their dreams. And I think most of us have this, the same core dreams. I mean, we want a happy, healthy family. We want, we want to ha have a, a good relationship with each other. I mean, we have this, we want to raise good kids. You know, we want to all retire well. So, you know, maybe together we can, we can uh, help each other achieve those dreams. So break it down in a nutshell. I know we talked about everything. Uh, what do you want 
Dallas to hear from you? Like one sentence or two sentences or what's your main line? I mean, you, we talked about so much. I mean. I don't, or, I don't know. I think we've said it all. <laughs> um, you know, it's, it's living with children. Uh, and the subtitle is Revolutionize Your Family. Right. And maybe just, you know, visit the website and support each other and help help us learn what we can do to you know what you need so that we can try to put that incorporate that in I mean we can't do everything but you know as much as we possibly can we want to show kind of the finer things in life too right. so that people can can see what they're you know something that they can dream for as well as you know help people that aren't maybe quite there yet that don't have the financial stability or just starting out in their careers or starting out their families and kind of set them on the right track so they don't suffer some of the things the older people have suffered and yeah. see I even written that you got you know spirituality which uh -huh. everybody needs that I believe yeah that's the key yeah but a lot of web pages they don't have they're just in the secular world and they don't go into spiritual right aspects and I like what you you know well it tells me what you're about you know? and I I, I don't want to you know there isn't one particular faith um, I think all of us agree in any faith that there's a higher power so you know right. we can but at least yeah. you acknowledge that you exactly know, a lot of people don't acknowledge so it. yeah and I think it's great for people because yeah. we've all had little miracles happen where we just Every can't day. believe that happened so so uh, I think that's neat that we can share those stories with each right. other and that's the other aspect that I think a lot of the other magazines miss out on is hearing back from the from there the it is. people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, we got about one minute left, and like I say uh, again, I appreciate you coming on my show. Thank you. Hope to have you again in the very near future. And, and this maybe is Tracy. I'll be better at this. <laughs> <laughs> this is Tracy R Ross with LivingWithChildren.com. That's your support site for your upcoming television. I believe God's going to use you in a mighty way. Uh, how I found out about you is through Esther Davis, and I want to give Esther Davis show my thanks. What for her, you wouldn't be here, I so know. God used her. And I thank her too. <laughs> you know, but Esther Davis is a good friend of mine. She's she's a dynamic lady, and uh, she helps a lot of people. And she, I think you know she's helped you probably many times. And um, you know, in the future, I'd like to have you on the show again and oh, see where you. you're going and absolutely we'd love to come back and and see you can we can talk about how we've grown and what we found yeah, out just blow up on us. <laughs> <laughs> but again trace I, I do thank you for the show coming on my show and this is gary springer show and it's springer wg at hotmail.com and that's how you get in contact with me and everybody at dc tv knows me pretty much and i guess that's the end of the story <laughs> and you want to say anything else? No, just thank you very much.